John and Mima. John loved his grandmother Mima. I think they were what you would call kindred spirits. Uh, they both like to be silly. They both love to laugh and goof off. Um, I remember when I knew John, I had to learn Mima's number if I ever wanted to get in touch with him <laughs> because most of the time he was across the street spending time with Mima. And I would call over there and sure enough, if John wasn't home, that's where he was. John and Mima had a very interesting relationship, um, or at least I thought so, because they both had the, sense, the same sense of humor. Although Mimo never showed it too often, but they had this ongoing understanding of each other's jokes with these cards she'd send, and he knew, ex like, we would read them, and we didn't really know what she was talking about, but he would think it was the funniest thing in the world, and reply and send something back to her. So they had this ongoing inside joke between them two that was the most hilarious thing to both of them. Um, and I know whenever he would do something good that he was proud of himself for, he couldn't wait to call her and tell her. Um, I, I mean, I, they had a wonderful relationship. Uh, she was way up there in his book, for sure. Um, I just have never in my life seen two kids look at John the way that they looked at him, and in the way that, I mean, just when y'all would call and say that they did something, and he would tell everybody in the house. He'd call me on the phone, he'd call Carol, guess what Jack and Maria did, or, um, and how excited he was when we were at the hospital when Maria was born. Um, just an indescribable relationship between him and both, both Jack and Maria. I was thinking about that earlier today. Um, I remember the, the best thing I can remember was when Jack was little and we'd hear the train and John would scoop him up and Paul tail all the way to the railroad tracks. We, I'm running behind him with the blanket because it's freezing outside and he just picked Jack up and starts running. So I'm running behind him with the blanket and we watch the train. When he would hear the train, he would get me and Maria and go over to the train tracks. And as we saw it go by, it just made me have a feeling and it was fun. Uncle John used to rush me and Jack over to the train when he heard it and he used to rush over to the tracks and we saw it and it was fun.